Hi, so the spooky season has come to a close and what does that mean? It means it's the start of November to celebrate film noir, neo-noir, all things noir. So the purpose of this video is for you to help me choose some films out of these two shelves here. I've got a lot of noir in my collection, some of which, many of which I've never seen. So, without further ado, I'm going to go through these two shelves. I want you to help me choose which ones to watch in Noir Vemba. So, I'm going to start with the film noir films from the 40s and 50s. Um, Big Heat, I've not seen that before. Is it any good? Should I watch it? Let me know in the comments below. Uh, Brighton Rock is a classic, but I've not seen that for a while. Brute Force, another good film. Cape Fear, Casablanca, a classic. Double Indemnity, that is definitely going to get watched again um, this month. I've not seen it for a few years, and it's deemed as one of the best film noirs of all time. In a Lonely Place. The Two Killers. Laura. The Maltese Falcon. I probably won't watch that, so I don't recommend it, because I've recently watched that um, in September, I believe. Um, the Naked City, that's due a rewatch, so is, as is The uh, Night of the Hunter. The French noir film Panique. Sam Samuel Fuller's Pick Up on South Street. I need to rewatch that, because I wasn't overly enamoured by it on my first watch. Rafifi, a classic, not seen that since um, I went to a film festival and saw it there, it were amazing. Um, the Hammer film noir, The Snorkel. The Third Man, another classic, needs a rewatch. Touch of Evil, another great film. Underworld USA, I've not seen that yet. White Heat, I've not seen that in decades. And then we get into the Columbia Noir box sets, right? So I've not seen any of these. So Escape in the Fog, The Undercover Man, Drive a Crooked Road, Five Against the House, The Garment Jungle, The Lineup. Can you recommend any of those? Which ones are the best ones out of that box set? Framed, The Ocean Drive, The Mob, Affair in Trinidad, Tight Spot, Murder by Contract. Can you recommend any of those in that box set? Johnny O'Clock, The Dark Past, Convicted, Between Midnight and Dawn, The Sniper, City of Fire. Walk a Crooked Mile, Walk East on Beacon, Pushover, Bullet is Waiting, Chicago Syndicate, The Brother Re Brothers Rico, and then the Humphrey Bogart Noir box set is Dead Reckoning, Knock on Any Door, Tokyo Joe, Sirocco. The Family Secret, The Harder They Fall. I would really like to get into a lot of those films in those box sets. So which ones are the standout films that I should be watching first? Let me know in the comments. Um, this is the first Arrow Academy film noir box set. That's still unopened. The Dark Mirror, Secret Beyond the Door, Force of Evil, The Big Combo. Is that the box set name, or is that... No, that is a film called The Big Combo. Um, and then we've got Alfred Hitchcock, um, there's Stab Saboteur and A Shadow of Doubt in there. I've seen them both, but they're definitely... I'm happy to re-watch those. At, right, so that's all the film noir, and then I'm moving on to the neo-noir. So, which one's out of these... Can you recommend at close range? I've not watched that yet. Um, somebody on Instagram recommended that to me, um, and I've still to watch it. Basic Instinct. I've not watched that in a very long time. That's due a rewatch, to be fair. <clears throat> uh, Blood Simple, classic Coen Brothers neo noir. Um, Bonnie and Clyde. Rolling Cell Block 99, Cape Fear, the remake, Chinatown, Collateral, 
cul-de-sac, Polanski's cul-de-sac. Any good? I don't know, let me know. Dark Blue, I haven't seen that since it came out, so that's due a rewatch. Deep Cover, The Departed, Drive, The Driver, Following, uh, not watched that yet. That's one of Christopher Nolan's first films. High and Low, A History of Violence, The Hotspot, Into the Night, Clute. I can't remember much about Clute. Is it any good? Can you let me know in the comments? La Ventura. Not seen that yet. I've heard it's really good. Um, Neo Noir. Let me know. Sorry, that's the dog scratching at the door. <laughs> Um, LA Confidential, a classic. I've not watched that in a while, so that is due a rewatch this month, definitely. Um, Le Samurai, Light Sleeper, just recently bought that. Is it any good? Let me know. The Long Goodbye, that's still unopened. I need to watch that. I've never seen it. There's a lot of the Melville films in here that are classed as uh, near. Neo Noirs, so can you recommend any of those? I will not try and pronounce those on on video, <laughs> but I have seen Le Circle, Le Circle Rouge, and I've seen Army of Shadows as well. But can you recommend any of the other ones? Um, Memento, Mona Lisa, not seen that in a long time. Nightcrawler. Great neo noir film is Nightcrawler. That's definitely due a rewatch, I think. No Country for Old Men, Nocturnal Animals, Old Boy, The Place Beyond the Pines. I can't remember much about that, so that might be due a rewatch this month. Quentin Tarantino's Pulp Fiction and Reservoir Dogs. Seven. Not in a rush to rewatch that. I've seen. I keep. I always watch that, so. I'm not in a rush to watch it if there's something else that you recommend. Seven Psychopaths, Shutter Island, the two Sin City films, which I haven't watched in a long time. State of Grace, that is definitely on the list of films to watch. Um, some people have recommended that to me and I've not seen it yet. Recently bought it as well, so that will definitely get watched in November. Taxi Driver. The Things to Do in Denver, When You're Dead, Under the Silver Lake, Usual Suspects, The Yellow Sea, and You Were Never Really Here. That's definitely due a rewatch. Um, so, I mean, the main, main films that I want you to recommend are probably from these box sets here. Um, I've not seen any of them. So, if any of you have seen these films and recommend them, let me know down in the comments. So there you go, that's the list of films I've picked out of my collection. I have got some others, but I've seen them recently, and to be fair, there's plenty to go at down there. Um, so yeah, help me out. Choose, choose some films that you've seen and you can recommend and let me know in the comments and I will try and get them watched if you recommend them highly enough. Thanks for watching, um, I'll see you again at the end of November.